Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Just a little summary of my multiple channel journey that I've taken with multiple channels. All of you know when I started that <clears throat> I wanted a multiple channel room. Didn't have many uh, much experience with one. Didn't know really how to treat it. You know, obviously lots of low frequency sources, so we're going to need lots of low frequency management. But my goal was always resolution two-channel resolution. That was the goal, you know. How do we take all of these channels and get them to sound like one, basically? You know, how do we get multiple channels to make them sound like mono, <laughs> in a way? But that was the goal. I, I didn't know if it was possible. I, physics says it's not possible. And it's pretty close to being right. And we'll, we'll talk about that. So, we want to get them to all work together and sound good. We want a huge sound stage with big width, you know. We want audio really to exceed the, the physical dimensions of the video screen. To, I think that's important, you know, and have a room that allows for that. So I was able to achieve, if I have to put a number to it, about 80% of the resolution with multiple channels as I get with two. You just can't be two channel for resolution. And think about it, it makes sense. Less energy, less sources, you know, just two things to worry about, a left and a right channel, instead of, you know, all of the others that go with it. But in multiple channel, you gotta have that synergy between the audio and the video, because if you get 80% satisfaction rate, 40% is that picture, video, you know, so you got to add all this together, you know, and, and, and figure out the, the visual impact and the audio resolution have to kind of work hand in hand. If one is way higher than the other, you know, I think there's, there's phase issues, if you will, there's, there's not balance in the presentation value. So it, it's a difficult formula to calculate, but I have to say, <sighs> It's about 80% of my two channel system. And it's when you get that kind of resolution and you put it in a large room, it's kind of special. It's, it's a way higher resolution than you're used to at, at that size of presentation, you know, cause our room is 65 feet across. So it can be as wide as so, some live venues that you go to, right? So the sides in the rear, the reflections from those are very critical. And I remember when multiple channels come out, they're like, ah, stick your sides in the rear behind your listening position, point them up at the ceiling, point them into the wall, point them behind you, point... Anyway, nobody knew what they were talking about. Point them what? All these different directions? No, you... There, there's a certain way to achieve it. Now, I work with music, so... I really could care less about movies, but there's some good soundtracks, mixes good audio on, on some movies. So we're always looking at music and we find that a, a balance in those reflections versus direct energy of the sides and the rear is very critical, very, very critical. You want a very similar resolution on the sides and the rears as you do the front of the house. And you're not gonna get that, fire them into a wall or in the corner wherever the hell they tell you to put them okay so i added up all the carbon in the studio twelve thousand pounds we've got six tons in our studio i know it's a lot but we get really really smooth curves and you can check our curves uh on past videos what are we going to do for for a further part of it uh we're going to put more carbon in the front of the house i'm still after an 80 cycle problem i'm going to get it and then we're going to put front wall diffusion and that's it. The studio will be done. So those of you that want to come and visit, this year is it. So you, you better get there this year. It's been, what, two and a half year journey? 3,300 hours I recorded in the studio listening. It's a lot. So you can see the dedication that's put into it. It's been a great journey. I'm glad I did it. Like I said in the beginning, I only had two channel experience. So I've learned a lot about treatment. Learned a lot about managing energy with four 13 and a half inch subs in the room. So you learn a lot in treatment, but uh, watch those rig videos and, and we have them in the project section of our website. So home at last. I've, I'm really almost home at the last part of the journey. And 
I'll report on that this year. So hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. And if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to. So please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple of days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis. So that'll help you. Thank you.